yeah. How's it feel? We're the safest I am all day. Yeah? Do you okay. want a little smaller? Yeah. <laughs> no one wants to see that. <laughs> this is gonna be a very humbling day. Hey guys, Ben here from Huckberry and welcome to Portland, Oregon. We are here for our fifth episode of our 72 hour series where I put my favorite adventure travel tea to the test. So in years past, we have gone on some adventures far, if you will. We have gone to some epic places and gone way the hell out there. For this year, we decided to keep it a little bit closer to home. Oregon is an outdoor, everyday adventure playground. We are shooting this in midsummer, so the days are long. We're packing it in. We're gonna see how much we can do in Oregon's backyard. 72 hours, episode five, let's go. First stop, OG Portland Brands. I didn't even realize how long they've been in Portland. We're going to Gerber. Legends in the outdoor knife carry space. This is the US manufacturing facility. Right now we got about 35% of our products that are coming out of this factory. Um, and at any given time we can ramp up 24 seven production as much as we need to keep up with demand. Is this where our collab products can be made? It is, it is. So Gerber started off as an advertising agency, yeah. which is why if you look back at some of the old ads and a lot of the creative back then, it was like, it was so good and so strong. The ironic thing is that they used to gift custom knives to their top clients each year. And so then they became known for their, their custom knives and the quality right. and they went from advertising into Gerber legendary blades. These products aren't mass produced. I mean, you got people here hand building them, hand sharpening them, and ultimately going out to the consumer with actual humans and, and people involved from every aspect of the of the creation of these products. So we launched our custom program a few years ago and ultimately with the goal of giving the consumer creative freedom. So when you say customizable, like what sort of things? Every single component you can colorize and custom. Great tour. Yeah. Thank you. Play with some knives? Yeah, let's do it. So I think you know, first and foremost, on your uh, on your day hikes, we got a couple uh, compact multi tools that are great just to have on you. A couple other products that might come in handy is our pack hatchet. You have fixed blades. The cool thing with a fixed blade, and I'll show you, it's called batoning. Basically, what we're going to do is just break down smaller pieces. Okay. Um, so, and this is why you need a good sturdy fixed blade that's got a full tang. Batoning. You want to try? That's my new party trick. There you go. It wasn't as pretty as yours, but. This is the fire striking right here where that flame is. You want to rake it against the, the ferrule rod. A lot of pressure here, a lot of cameras. There you go. Cue Billy Joel. Thanks again, man. Yeah, appreciate it. Time Good to hit the road. Yeah. Got us hooked up. Let's right. go. Coming back with all 10 fingers. Cool. Do you have band-aids? <laughs> we do have a first okay. aid kit. Good question. I'm meeting up with Rashad, Camp Yoshi, year two. He's part of 72 hour, but now on his home turf. One of my favorite humans on the planet. I hope this is Rashad. Who is this? What's up, dude? Do you know my friend Ian? I don't. Ian, Ben. Ian, nice to meet you. Nice to meet yeah. you. Is it, this is your shop? This is my shop, yeah. Okay. yeah. So we gotta make today count. So yeah. this first stop, obviously gonna hit home. Provador is amazing. And then we head on up to the mountains, man. So, Love it. you guys want anything crew? No? Donut? Yeah, yeah, come on, get some coffee, guys. Put spend some money in my man's shop. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on a second, can we talk about how buff you look in this I look all right, dog? man. Uh, oh, you think you're nice? I was trying to, I was trying to do N1 mixtape. <laughs> <Shut> <laughs> <up>. <laughs> Appreciate it, man. Yeah, yeah, love you too, man. Have a, a good one. Come Good to meet you, man. Nice to meet you too. Yeah, thank you for having us. Of course. Yeah, yeah we'll be back. When I get buff, uh, <laughs> let's go. We'll yeah. send you whatever you need. I like this spot a lot, man, because I can prep a lot of stuff for me quickly on the fly. But more importantly, the ingredients are pretty amazing as well. So, cool. Yeah. I just learned how to start a fire. With, oh, there you go. With, with some knives. <laughs> So, I'm gonna be your sous chef. All right, cool. So we're picking up some protein here, a whole chicken that's been butterfly, and then we'll push on. I think we're gonna eat really good. Yeah, I think we're gonna eat really, really good. Hey, you're 
let's go. Fancy seeing you here. Likewise, man, you lost? <laughs> a little bit? I won't see the height, so I don't want to blow up the spot, but we're, we're in gonna... Oregon, we're in Portland, so that means we're chasing waterfalls. We're not going to blow up the spot. Okay. But this is an hour from your oh, front door. It's close, man. Get up here early in the morning, hike it, be back in time for brunch. I love That's it. That's how I look at this experience. So, it's an everyday it? adventure at its best. Yeah. We're going to hike. Yep. Get some shots. Hang run out. to the top. Yep. Get some not water. run, but no. then we're going to come back and we're going to cook. We're going to eat really well, actually. The reward for the hike should be amazing, though. So, I'll keep that a surprise. All right, ready to do it? Let's cool. go. Let's hit it. All right, cool. <laughs> How many hours in are we? Too early to start asking strangers to smell me. Bro, this is in my own backyard, man. I mean, I don't need a view. I need this. I need, yeah. a, I need a tree bat. Oh, shit. I like that tree bat. Like That's that? It, dude. Yeah. Let's go. I can feel it. I've added to my uh, manifest for our trips. In fact, you can smell the water, like, you can just smell it. <laughs> it's pretty well, right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right? That's a waterfall. Yeah. That's the reward for our work. Yeah, that water is powerful, bro. The wind? Cold. Woo! Oh, we got different colorways, bro. What is this? Black. What's black? Oh, it's like a stone. Navy. Okay. What's this then? That's Navy. That's Navy, okay. Cool. Epic. Course, you me? never let us down. Of course, dude. Come on, man. This is all about, man. This is also a vacation for you as well. It is. Yeah. It was yeah. a refresh I needed. Yeah. But, I mean, this took us 45 minutes. Oh, like, quick, from right? our car to this shit. Oh, this is what it's all about, man. This is why I love Oregon. There's so much low hanging fruit in your own backyard, so. Literally. Yeah. This is amazing. It also smells amazing. Oh, look at that. The boys are gonna stay warm tonight. Oh, I hope you got that one on camera. That was clean. Oh, 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 oh no, yeah, we got a flame. Me to work. Yeah, man. Yes, chef. It's too, it's too easy. Oh, that looks better. Yeah, there you go. Nice. So the issue sometimes when you're cooking outdoors is everything gets cold so quick. So having the hot cream sauce, it kind of helps the person eating it not get cold food, you know? Are you putting? Oh, no, you didn't. Yes, I did. See how far we've come since Utah? That's so good. As good as corn, dude. Please get the corn. Get the corn. Go. That corn is so good. 72 hour Oregon, day one in the books. To smelling fresh for two more days. Morale is high. You don't have to travel far, you just have to travel well. Oh, let's go. Poetic. Is that the bar? Okay, man. Let's go. We are on our way to Pacific City. Driving from Portland to the Oregon coast. You see our buddy Ben Moon and Sophie Cooler. We're gonna spend the day in their shoes, surfboard, whatever they wanna throw at us. Look at this. Hi. How are you guys? Good to finally yeah, meet in person. Yeah. yeah, are we gonna get you in the ocean or what? Yeah. See yeah. that? I mean, I'll get in the ocean. I don't know what I'll do in the ocean, <laughs> but I'll, I'll fucking get in it. Around. It'll be fun. Yeah, yeah. I've surfed. Well, I've been on a surfboard twice in my life in oh. Charleston, South Carolina, which like the waves were water so, a little warmer and that there. Was Ten years ago, and the water was warmer. Yeah. So you're pro. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Sharks are bigger here too. Yeah, I know. We talked about that. One. <laughs> don't remind me. You know what? Like the ocean, the ocean always, ocean, the ocean right? always puts you back on the beach unless yeah. you unless you get stuck in a rip. So it's like. <laughs> I have gotten stuck in the rib before. So, might take. Well, this was a garage. 
Do you have a wetsuit that will yeah, fit me? Yeah. You can wear mine. <laughs> Let's try that. <laughs> Get that on camera. Wait, there, yeah. wait, you think a large would work? I hope so. <laughs> Maybe a little I short. Probably need a large tall. Oh, yeah. It'll work. <laughs> Do you get cold in the water, or are you like more of a like? I mean, I, I talk a big like game a... again with, like, <laughs> with the main with the main roots, but I haven't lived in Maine in like 20 years, so it's also Kevlar. Too, the one I wore in Iceland when I was making that Creation Theory film, I was like, that's the one. Water it's the one. Remember when we did the one we sell like shark repellent, but we did at one point. We sold it. Yeah, I think we sold it. Buy a million units. <laughs> what are these? E-bikes. These two are dual motors, so they rip. So they have, but these both have surfboard racks on. For safety and thumping, you'll be all, you'll be all yeah. foamy. For everybody's <laughs> general safety. I mean, if you feel unsafe with this, we could just go to a bar. And <laughs> get you some fish and chips. Yeah, we can get some fish and chips. <laughs> so. Woohoo! Cold, all right. <laughs> Pull a little left. <laughs> there we go. There you go. There it is. Freedom! So how do you feel after that? I feel good. I'm still high. Riding high. No pun intended. <laughs> I was riding very low. And uh, let's go take a wander. There's um, some some spots over here I want to show you. Check it out. I don't want to say too much because... Don't give it away. Don't pull up the spot yet. Come on, Arsh. Look at this. So this is it. <laughs> Welcome to the dune. I get used to these mid-afternoon hikes to epic places. <laughs> it's our backyard. Uh, Rashad was like, yeah, it's like, it was like 3.30. I'm like, we have time for this? He's like, of course we do. Brought us this epic waterfall. Oh, did Amazing. It? A lot of times we'll take a walk and then just come, come watch for right. here just yeah. to see if, how it looks. And, and if it looks good, you usually sprint you back. Run back. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> there were the waves that I conquered. Nice, dude. Second nature. Yes. Yeah. That is a view. Not bad. Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> Should roll down. See if your shirt survives it. Great idea. Oh, find out. <laughs> <laughs> Sniff it. <laughs> <laughs> Smells good, actually. You, got, you whipped it all out. <laughs> We're all just For a second, I was like, oh god. I mean, you guys would have caught me, but I'm like, what if I go that way? It's kind of insane to just like yeah. be able to like walk from the house and it really is. It's insane. Like film this little adventure. Cause I mean, we feel it every time too. It's like it's, it never gets old. Yeah. Alex wants to race up the sand dune. Race up the dune. <laughs> We're going to the top of that. We're going the fast way home. Wow, this is not a good idea. Oh. Ben, you still think this was a good idea? No. Yeah, Ben. <laughs> it's a nice, cool breeze right now, so it feels good. Have fire. Hell yeah. All right, oh. all right. Smell me. Check. There we go. That's a real smell test there. Dude, it's fine. Roses. Duncan, 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 Duncan. Yeah, it's a special place. I get it. And when we were driving in, everyone's like, "You're gonna love Pacific yeah, City." I nice. mean, we haven't had a beer yet. I know. First time surfing. We just scaled a fucking like 300 foot sand wall. It'll be your first beer too, right? First beer. Yeah. <laughs> first beer ever. Nailed it. <laughs> Wow. 
One minute bike ride to the surf spot. 30 second walk to the trail. Maybe a one minute drive here. Pretty epic. Thank you guys, this is yeah. awesome. Thanks for coming out. I'm kind of only saw a fraction of it, but there's a lot more we haven't, you know. I'll be careful. Dipped into it. I'll be coming back. <laughs> Pretty big day. It's gonna be fun. Four hours to bend. We're gonna be with Jeremy, our resident Huckberry employee, outpost and bend. Jeremy's got big shoes to fill. The newest Huckberry employee. Hey, we are really him. putting him on the spot. <laughs> when we were trying to hire him, his one non-negotiable is I am not leaving Ben, so we're about to go find out why. Oh yeah. So, where are we? We are five miles outside Five downtown. miles outside downtown on the Deschutes River Trail. Jeremy is one of our newest Huckberry employees. Your backyards are so annoyingly amazing and accessible. Oregon is a different level. Oh, Did you take the chain off? <laughs> I didn't do anything. I did not do anything. I did, I've just been holding it. That was not me. That is... Equipment error, <laughs> that is not user. He's really confident saying he can ride a bike. Let's really make him look like an <laughs> asshole. All right, he's good to go now. <laughs> Try that again, pick two. Oh, that's amazing. A little boat ramp? Yeah, man. Mighty Deschutes. It's a nice place for a dip. Don't, shallow Don't die. Stay <laughs> shallow. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, that is cold. <laughs> oh, shit. We have a crew, so I have a towel, but in a pinch. 72 hour also works as a quick drying towel. Yeah. Let's go. Appreciate it. Thank you. That was awesome. Thanks for coming. Just what the doctor ordered. Yeah. A little swim, a little ride. A little swim, a little ride. Now it's time for a beer. No, yeah. We did just enough to earn that beer. Bad Brewing Co. My favorite is Tropical Pines. It's got mosaic hops, it's really clean, kind of citrusy. What will you have, Mason? Oh, shit. He's wearing it. I'll yeah, buy you I'm one. Sure. Sorry, man. <laughs> Couldn't have planned that better. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Wow. We are in that goal. I'm not going to speak for you, but you've watched the 72 hours. Yep. yep. We did not pay See. him or tea that this is random. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right? yeah, yeah, yeah. Believe it or not, this is our first like official. We've had a few beers along the way. Right. Our, <laughs> the first official first brewery. brewery. Yeah, yeah, right on. You know what it's I got to ask you since you've watched a few? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 66 yeah, oh. hours. <laughs> it's true. It's true. It's no joke. Look at that. This is awesome. Nice meeting you guys. Good to see you, man. Cheers. Thanks. Wow, that was cool. That was not planned. Yeah, Mikey recommended these and you did not let us down. These tots are amazing. It's a lot of good looking rock. Beauty is an eye of the beholder, as they say. It's like if they designed a little Disneyland for climbers. Seriously. Like floating river. They place some eagles up here. Beautiful walkways and pads. Yeah. Everything's built out. Gonna fluff his feathers a little bit. Not only he's a good climber, blah, blah, blah. Uh, Alex has actually been the catalyst for a number of current and previous Huckberry employees getting into climbing. That's true. And are now like climbers themselves, not just have been climbing. Yeah. You created a little climbing culture. I've been asking for 10 years for Alex <laughs> to bring me. He took putting them on camera to finally let me be part of the club. Yeah, I'm excited for you to try it. So you've never, never climbed before, first time? No, I've never like actually climbed. 
This was like the uh, birthplace of sport climbing in the United States. It's definitely got a lot of history in the climbing world. Yeah, it's such an epic hike. What a sweet place. It's pretty insane. Yeah, it's so cool. Poker face. I'm terrified, exhausted, confident. No. I'm not going all the way up there. No fucking way. When I get to the top, I'll, I'll set up like a more permanent anchor. I'll just be in communication, but it'll just, just keep be. Going by the whole time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So sick. Ben, you're not gonna like that part. I'm not gonna do that part. <laughs> Is this a 13? Oh, I can't. This is a 10. God. We have some grease. Right leg, left leg. Yep. What do you need? I just need a knife. You got Jeremy. There it is, yeah. He also lives here. It's kind of like in his blood, whether he admits to <laughs> never climbing it before or not. Good girl. Nice. That was good. You, was look, you look good for a second. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks for saving me. <laughs> okay, so the biggest thing with like this style of climbing is trusting your feet. So you're gonna have small footholds almost the entire way up. Like there's gonna be chalk everywhere. So that's gonna kind of be your guide as to like what the holds are. Yep. Um, and as you, so you're gonna get to each of these. Not a lot of chalk in that section. <laughs> I think you're gonna do great though. Yeah, nice. You have a great time. Look around too when you're up there. It's uh, it's quite nice. I saw it from the trailhead <laughs> at the top. <laughs> Where's my first? This is part of the challenge. You have to figure it out. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> yes. Nice. Yeah. Very nice. I'm good. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, that's the right idea. Just look for anything on that wall that you can use as a foot. There's oh. gonna be little nubbins. There you go. Get the shot. That's uh, fun. <laughs> I get it. It's hard. Ben, you hooked? I'm getting back on that wall. Get me those anchors. Make you work for it. Final push. Final, 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 final. Glad you got on the ribs. I got on them. Yeah. Got on a wall. Yeah. 20 feet. Hey, it's better than nothing. If I tell people 30, will you correct me? 35, I'll say 35. That is not only the beer to end the day, but the beer Cheers. commemorates 72 hours. I'm, I'm fucking toast. Yeah. I've been tired on other 72 hour trips. Not like this. But like physically, I am tired. Not emotionally, but I'm fucking tired. <laughs> We've said it again, but like in all these people's backyards. And that was my favorite part. What people do in their sort of day to day and like yeah. the everyday adventure. And like people taking the time, like you, getting me out doing new shit. Yeah. Pretty cool. It wouldn't be a 72 hour adventure without the ceremonial last sniff. <laughs> Alex, <laughs> you get the part. honor. Wind, all Wind is blowing. Trip. It's great. I nothing. mean, nothing. We know the answer, the ending <laughs> to this story, but you got to do it. Yeah. 72 hours, Oregon. See you out there. See you next time. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you.